Well, what you are seeing right now are some images that were generated by Gemini AI. And as usual, there is a tiny watermark at the bottom right corner of the picture. This is true even if you're paying for the pro version of Gemini. But as you can see, I got a version without a watermark whatsoever. And interestingly, this picture without the watermark was actually modified or the watermark has been removed directly in Gemini AI. So yeah, there is actually a feature in Gemini that we can utilize to remove the watermark that was created by the image model, which is Gemini Nano Banana Pro in Gemini AI. So yeah, we can use a feature in Gemini to solve a problem that was created by another feature within the same platform. It is very interesting. So if you are interested to remove watermark using Gemini, then let me show you how you can do it. Let's open Gemini. In this case, I'm using the desktop web version, but of course you can apply this method even on the mobile app version of Gemini. Now, after that, or actually before that, I do recommend to save the picture that you want to modify to your computer first. Now I have this picture that I'm going to use for this demonstration. And of course we got this tiny watermark. Now let's move on. So on Gemini, you can insert this prompt. And by the way, this prompt can be found in the description down below. Just copy the text. And after that, let's paste that onto Gemini. And basically, this prompt is telling Gemini to create a simple app that is utilizing a feature from Photoshop that I'll talk about later. But basically, we can use that feature to remove a watermark in a photo. Now, after that, click Tools, click canvas and i do recommend to use the thinking model because we are after all trying to create an app which requires some coding so just use the thinking model and click submit now just wait for about three minutes for this ai tool to create an app that later we can utilize to remove watermark and i'll explain how you can actually use the app anyway this will take quite some time so i'll be back in a second Okay, so this is the app and I do recommend to open it with a bigger screen. You can click the share button, click share again, and you can copy the link and you can open that link on a new tab. So even though you might be using the exact same prompt, the layout could be a bit different, but the main goal or the main purpose of the tool would be more or less the same. And here, as you can see, we got some tools like the brush, this, you can adjust the size, hardness, the opacity, and also we got this some small guidance on how you can use the tool. It is actually very simple. So what you need to do is you just need to upload the picture and let's select this picture open there you go so here uh, we want to copy the area around this watermark and then we want to put that to the watermark itself so it is essentially the clone stamp tool in photoshop it is actually very simple so let me just uh, adjust the size of the brush and maybe the hardness a bit and i'm going to copy maybe around this area let me try maybe this Let's put it here let's try this and then this this and then this oops maybe not i'm going to press ctrl z uh i do recommend to use the area surrounding the watermark to get the best result and let me copy this and this there you go is it perfect no but i think it is safe to say that we just removed the watermark from the photo and if you're quite happy with the result you can click save and you'll get a new version without the watermark so let me show you the original picture it looked like this and this is the modified version without the watermark watermark without watermark it's maybe if you zoom in enough you can tell that it is not a good editing but for the most part, I think the watermark is basically gone from the picture. So yeah, we are using the feature from Gemini called Gemini Canvas to fix the watermark problem that was caused by the image generation, which is Gemini Nano Banana model. So we can get a much cleaner picture. So it's very interesting. And again, the full prompt is going to be available in the description down below. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you on my next video. I wish you a great day ahead.